the Commute Zero scooter. Powerful enough to carry an adult up steep hills, yet affordable enough that anyone could buy it. Make sure to watch to the end of this video to learn about all of the amazing features this affordable electric scooter has to offer. In this video, we're going to be unboxing and reviewing this electric Commute Zero scooter sold by Fitnest on Amazon. I will include the link in the description below. So first things first, we will open up this box and see what's inside. All right, so the box is open and it looks like it was packaged and shipped very well. Let's pull this scooter out, see what's included and see how we're going to put it together. All right, the scooter is out of the box. It was really simple and easy to pull it out. All you have to do is grab onto this pole right here, this uh, handlebar um, bar and pull it out, super simple. Now it looks like it is basically just the handlebars that are not connected. We will connect those. So it comes with this charger setup that was in this box. So all you have to do is pull it out. Um, obviously we are going to charge this before we use it. Make sure the battery is fully charged. Comes with some screws as well and some Allen wrenches and a user manual. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to pull these, I don't know what these are, styrofoam or plastic pieces off and then I'll start setting this up. So the brake is already connected, but we have to plug in these two wires really quick. So we're going to pull these handlebars up and lock it into place. That way we can work on these handlebars. Now, all you have to do is pull the handlebar up and push this piece right here in and it will lock it into place. The handlebar is locked now. What we wanna do is plug these two plugs in really quick that are connected to the handlebar. And then we're going to push the wire in there and push this handlebar into place. So once the wires are in far enough, this bar, the handlebars will just go into this bar very easily. And there, it's just about done. There we go. Now these holes are lining up. So we're going to put the screws in on the back and on the front right there. And once you're done, this is the finished product. Super simple to put together, guys. It was really quick. It probably took about 15 minutes. Really easy. Now all we have to do is take off these plastic covers really quick. That should be really easy. There we go. And yeah, not bad at all. Okay, this one's a little harder. Okay, not bad at all. Looks great. So next part of this video, guys, we are going to be reviewing this scooter, checking it out, seeing how it performs and talking about different features. Um, I'm gonna talk about what I like about it, talk about how it works and uh, different things that you need to know about it if you're going to purchase one. This is the Commute Zero electric scooter sold by Fitnest. And I couldn't recommend this scooter enough, guys. It is absolutely amazing. So as you can see, the design is very nice. It is well made. The scooter looks great. It is very strong and it is just well designed and well built. Looks great and it rides great. This scooter has a 250 watt electric front motor and it is very powerful. It has an LCD screen, which is very bright. You could see it in bright sunlight and it works great. It shows you your battery life, your speed in miles per hour and different modes. This scooter has three different modes, eco, drive and sport. In eco, you can go up to nine miles an hour. In drive, you can go up to 12 miles an hour. And in sport, you can go up to 15 miles per hour, 15.5 miles per hour. There's sport right there. Screen works great. A lot of scooters have screens like this, but some of them aren't as good. Uh, this one actually has a really good screen. It works great. It also has a headlight which is really cool. It also has really nice grips. They don't slide, they feel, feel really good, and they work well. So you don't get tired of riding the scooter with these grips, and uh, I don't feel the need to change them either because they work great. Another feature the scooter has is it has a physical disc brake. This scooter has 8.5 inch anti-slip tires, and they are puncture proof. So you don't have to worry about getting flats and basically getting stranded somewhere. These tires are really well designed. 
The scooter has a lithium battery and the range is 14 to 15 miles per charge. I have used the scooter and tested it and I was able to do 12 miles easy, over 12 miles with two bars left on the battery. And that is really crazy. I actually think that that is amazing and I, uh, I'm definitely happy with that kind of range. And I'm pretty sure you can easily do the 14 to 15 miles with no problem. So like I said before, it is well made. It's made out of high quality aluminum and it is lightweight. It's easy to fold as well. I'll show you guys how to fold it right now. Now to, to fold the scooter, all you have to do is push this button up and pull on it and then it will go down. And once it goes down, it will lock right there onto the back fender and then you can lift it up. So very small, very handy. You can carry the scooter, depending on how strong you are, um, easily with one arm. I'm able to do that without any problems and throw it in a car trunk. And look how small this thing is. Very small and I really like the finish. The paint is very high quality, doesn't scratch or scuff easily. And it looks like this uh, frame will last a very long time. So like I said before, this scooter is very lightweight. It only weighs 27.5 pounds, goes up hills without any problems. I was actually very surprised with this because some scooters can't even go up small inclines like the sidewalk. This scooter can go up big hills. So I'm very happy about that. So you can find this scooter on Amazon. I will be using this scooter from now on. I'm going to be riding this scooter on the bike trails today. It's going to be awesome, guys. So I definitely recommend this scooter. I think it's amazing. And you can find the scooter on Amazon. I will link it in the description where to buy it. If you guys are looking for an electric scooter, I would buy this one. It's great quality and it is water resistant as well. So you don't have to worry about it. This scooter also has cruise control. If you hold the throttle for a certain amount of time, I think it's within a few seconds, it will uh, set the cruise control, which is very cool. You don't have to hold the cruise control if you're going on a long trip for a few miles. Um, and I think that's very cool. Now to disengage the cruise control, you want to tap the throttle once and it will turn off the cruise control or just hit the brake. And I did forget to mention that this scooter does charge within four to five hours, which is a pretty fast charging time. I've had scooters that would take 12 hours to charge and I think that's unacceptable. I think the scooter is built great all the way around. I think it has the best features and I think it's a great value as well, guys. So go check this out on Amazon and thank you guys for watching.